Let's just say my shift didn't end on a good note last night. I'm really tired of them coming and picking a bone with me. And they claim there's no bone to pick. Yeah. It's the same man dressed up before that came after me. They give up on everything altogether. And cut Amazon out of my experience, out of my list of experiences. do that the next time this kind of thing happens that they send me home over over being mad at them as far as I'm concerned there is nothing right about that I function just fine even when I'm even when I'm pissed off at them even if they don't realize it going after me and pissing me off they're creating the threat when I get that mad. It is a threat when I get that mad. That's why I have to work. That's why I'm trying to control it. But they aren't making it very easy. There are a few in there that have tried to help me out. And there are a few that are not stupid enough to push me like that. Anyways, I'll let you guys go. Well, first they decide to uh, send me home early on Friday. Now they don't want to let me in on Monday. Seriously. This is why I hate corporations so much. They think they can get away with anything they want just because they're multi-billion dollar companies. <sighs> Someone needs to put these folks in their place. Give them a little wake up call that they are not invincible. They are just as easy to take down as any other company, as anyone else. Basically what happened was that one of the managers decided to come at me and give me a little, give me a write up in the behavior department, as every company does, has a, write-ups for different areas and it pissed me off because personally he didn't say he was gonna do it that they didn't say they were gonna do it that night they said if whatever what the write-up was for he told me they'd do it if they if it continued it didn't happen again but they were chose to do it anyways I still chose to justify so yeah they just pissed me off again big fucking mistake and pardon my language but when I am pissed guys I will curse I do tend to curse I specifically avoided it 
while I was at work. I had enough restraint to do that, but it did not help lower. It only made the temper feel a lot worse. What I basically did was I yelled at the manager for doing what he's doing. I've yelled at him three times already about his behavior, about the way he's doing things, and he is not doing it the way the other managers do. It's part of the reason most people don't like him. In fact, he, this manager, guys, as I've told the folks at work, he is the whole reason I consider quitting. This, as far as I'm concerned, is a problem. I have plenty of issues with it if they don't, if it's not overturned. Plenty. Because that's going to cost me just about everything. And when I go homeless, oh, you do not want to know what will happen. With You do not want to know what I'm going to do. This for starts, Amazon's going my, uh, to, my employers, yeah. You know, I'll let you go. I'm going to stop because of this car. But to continue what I was saying a little bit ago. They will end up in a lot of trouble. Because well, I pretty much know everything they've messed up on. next problem I report, the next problem I see, I will report. I'm getting tired of them doing this stuff to me. And it always seems to be me. They never go after anybody else. Always me. That's what's pissing me off. The most. As I'm back, to continue my com my topic before, they've gotten out of control, Amazon I mean, so instead of waiting till August, I'm going to quit as soon as possible. I'm not going to deal with this crap anymore. They might, I may end up on they may find me on good terms with them, but truth is, they're on bad terms with me. Corporations like this, I cannot tolerate. Don't you dare turn right there, don't. One of, it's one, Amazon, by the way, guys, is one of the most hated employers out there. They might claim I feel that way, but it's a fact. I hear about it every night. Every night that I have to go in, I hear about it. And I notice it on my own as well. So in the end, they just caused a huge problem for me. This is affecting my ability to sustain a living at all. So if Amazon wants to keep going down this road, I'll give them a little information. Keep going down this road, 
and I will quit within exactly one week after this once this shift is up one and if it's pushed further one day I am already dealing with enough problems and all Amazon is doing is creating more problems for me constantly I'm officially done with them at this point done I'm not gonna wait for my stocks in August in the end I'm getting a job closer to home even if I have to go back to Walmart and convince them to give me full time because I will not take less than full time hours I won't As I've told others, the worst employer I have ever worked for. That's something they should be ashamed of, knowing that everyone agrees, that everyone I know agrees that they are the worst company to work for. They write startled me it's, at this point it's just gotten out of control I can't deal with it anymore back up to my old neighborhood by the way but honestly I still need to talk about this if anyone ever even considers working for Amazon be just be very careful and look at the reviews first look at how many bad reviews they have compared to good I've seen more good reviews for Trader Joe's than with Amazon. I've seen more good reviews with Walmart than with Amazon. And Walmart's a better employer, definitely. I, I will definitely give them that. What the? Tree fell. Or at least parsley fell. Oh, that's bamboo. Never mind. The bamboo might be dying. But anyways, back to the topic at hand, and I am easily distracted, guys, so bear with me. As I've said earlier, because of all the problems they keep giving me at Amazon, I am leaving them, and I'm going to try and get my job at Walmart back and this time if I go for Walmart if I do get the job at Walmart it better be full time and I'm close to my old neighborhood done talking about Amazon because honestly I keep going on about it I'm just gonna get angry again I've got no patience left with them basically going to visit 
as I said earlier, I'm going to visit my old neighborhood again, and I'm almost there. Let's hope someone's awake. Because I need help finding a job soon. Unfortunately, no one's awake. One of the cats was outside. One of the my friend's cat was outside, but no one's awake. Unfortunately. I'm gonna go ahead and head back home. Pretty much just do my own thing and find some way to make the money that Apple keeps taking from me. There is no bill that I have to pay from them that costs 49 freaking dollars. Nor is there a $50 bill, really. Because honestly, I didn't pay for anything that costs that much. I have no Apple, I do not have an actual Apple TV subscription. I'm just using a stupid app for my movies. And what do they do? They charge me for it. <sighs> now I had next to no money for a week. The world has gone out. This world is out of control. It's time we put someone in there in these high it's time we put someone in these companies that knows better. And I can point out to these companies prices don't need to be raised anymore. These import taxes need to drop since the dollar is finally stabilized. is out of control. Corporations, government, everything. There's only two corporations that I'm actually willing to work for right now and that's Food Lion and Walmart. They're the only good ones left. Because last time I worked for Walmart, Yeah, it was beyond it was beyond easy in there. That was one of the easiest places I've ever worked for. Amazon their demands are next to impossible. Oh yeah, and there's also Trader Joe's. I've applied there too. Are you kidding me? The freaking battery again! Sorry to end this on a little bit of a sour note. Sorry about that, guys. But, uh, I have to go. So, for those of you who enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. Peace out.